years ago in Summer League. Don't forget, coming up next, it's Buddy Heald and the Pelicans taking on the Los Angeles Lakers. Stick around. We'll be right back. Starting now with uh, Bu Buddy Heald. He's NBA ready. Buddy Heald, the two-time Big 12 player of the year, former All-American, as we look at the starting lineups for game two, ready to get underway. Russell also getting to start for the Los Angeles Lakers. A guy that was all rookie second team this past season. The NBA Drew has been in and out of the league. Nance with the rebound. He can hop like his dad a little bit, and here's the first professional touch for Brandon Ingram, and he makes it. It's a fresh, uncomfortable experience for them. I've heard some rookies say, I just want to draw iron on my first shot. I don't want to shoot an air ball. Nice back down low by Zuba. In particular, I remember that game that he single-handedly won at LSU. Brown back to Nance Jr. Well, he said he was working on his three-point shot. Knocks that one down. It's 11-0. If he can add that with the way the NBA game is played, that pop, you know, pick and pop and the ability to shoot it. Check Diallo finally gets the Pelicans on the board. Tom, check Diallo taking a bunch of sodium tablets or whatever it is they take these days. That's what they did back in the old days with guys like you and I, Tom. Penn. You know, you sweat a lot. And one. And that was Ryan Boatwright on the baseline. Let's uh, bring in a man in the talk a little bit more Lakers what do you think yeah it's funny the crowd is into it you know they're, they're off to a great start to like, this is their actual NBA roster <laughs> this is not a summer league team uh, Jordan Clarkson who yeah. they re-signed four years 50 million dollars uh, Amin mentioned Mozgov he signed four years 64 Jose Calderon oh, just... Marcelo Huertas expected to come back and that was a way downtown ditch for sure. Um, Heald. Blocked by Zubach. Zubach with another jack. Los Angeles, meanwhile, has misfired on its last five shots. Ingram with a nice take. Silky, smooth left-hand finish. He's been sloppy with the ball, and he's a sophomore. Mm. This is his second summer league. The way that Moutier took over the last game, you would expect this kid to do the same. Yeah, we're starting to see it. But you want D'Angelo Russell to express himself and exert himself on this game. Turns the corner, finishes aggressively. That's what you need him to do, attack the rim. And again, see, feels the mismatch, finishes, takes the contact. Won it back towards the end of the season and went on a nice roll at the offensive end in particular. And uh, in between all of that, he was involved in that uh, clandestine video incident with his teammate Nick Young, which caused a little bit of disturbance in the locker room. There's the quickness. Things could get better faster well look at cleveland lebron went back there because of the young kyrie irving and the other young players they had that's what was appealing enough to him he knew he could fix it and make it better he saw the core was there the lakers need to express enough of that oh he hit him with the hensi Rocked Minarath. I mean, just because it's family doesn't mean it's good. Right. Uh, so we've had some challenging situations where the wrong person's there, right from the family. Big time post move from Zubak. This crowd is loving this young, young team here. Uh, but, you know, back to your point and your question, it's, uh, there's so much of an adjustment, so much goes on. Under here, way here in the third quarter. Here's Russell on the wing. Zubac working one on one. Tough shot, and he knocks it down. A great post move. You know, the starters have outscored. Uh, he got challenged down there by Diallo. Just got big and tall, did not foul. 
That's a tough thing for big guys, uh, young bigs in the NBA. Well, maybe that'll get... Zubac couldn't find the handle. And Buddy on the loose again. Someone hit the delete button. Well, he didn't avoid that shot block. <laughs> Nance came from the rafters. To Come on over and take a look at my ring when you get a chance. <laughs> Dad, the assistant coach on the staff of Tyron Lue and the Cleveland Cavaliers. As Russell knocks down the three ball. <laughs> uh, Nick, you're in, huh? Came up with that master plan last year in the championship, right? To start Iguodala and turn the flow of that series around. Kevin Durant was a dominant rebounder in college. And Anthony Brown comes off the weak side pin down and knocks it down. But he healed with a long two. Since last year. Yeah, great point. And, you know, Alvin Gentry's coaching lineage is healed. Buddy Heal, just 5 of 18 in this game. Three on the shot clock. Had to go, and it works. Being drafted in the league. Which way is that trending right now? Any any feel for that? Well, uh, there's clearly a, a uh, focus on the fundamentals that occurs overseas. San Antonio Spurs, uh, interesting note. Uh, Boban Marjanovic signing. Uh, yeah. I mean, you know, <laughs> what? Funny how that works, right, Tom? Nobody yeah. complaining about that. Yeah. Yeah. Great point. A.T. Yeah. Harrell out of Auburn. Diallo with the jam. Bring him down the hammer. His whole thing, look at him run the floor, call for the ball, now finish. Nice left hand by Diallo. There you go. That's something that the coaching staff loves to see. Play right down to the final tick. Look at those shoes. What's up with that? Hot pink. These are uh, the Kobe nines, but I mean, you're you're the you're the kicks guy too, right? I, I'm trying to be. <laughs> I'm trying to be. <laughs> No, it's, it's funny because you look at Chick Diablo sneakers, and usually... <laughs> hey, this is the forum for experimenting with new rules, right? Summer League, so... Diallo. Diallo. Great start for the Lakers. That's just what they wanted. Russell and Ingram to shine and to do it in tandem. See how the rest of the week plays out for them. The final score, Lakers 85, the Pelicans 65. D'Angelo Russell with 20, Ingram with 12. For Tom Penn, Amin Al-Hassan, I'm Mark Jones saying good night from Las Vegas Sports Center. Coming up next.